Hello everyone. So welcome to the channel of RD Automation Learning. So in this video, we would tell you about the changes that are happening in the IT job market and what are the things that would be evolving in the upcoming time. So let's look into the video, into the details. And before we deep dive into this particular topic, I would like to tell you about a package that has been created to assist every one of you to clear the interviews. So this package contains all the testing interview questions and answers that are generally asked in an interview. Let it be a service-based company or it can be an MNC company, startup-based company. And you need to be prepared for this kind of question. So this package will contain all interview questions and answers that will assist you to clear the interviews, right? So you can avail it at a discounted rate today. So I would be putting the link in the comment section as well as in the description of video so that you can avail it. Let's look into the details of what happening, what is happening in the IT job market and uh, how can we move ahead, how to get more interview calls, how to get more jobs over here. Now, before we move ahead, let me tell you about the traditional service model, right? You might be aware and uh, what is the evolving service model these days. The traditional service model says, if you're working in a service-based company, you might be aware about the term that is billing. So billing refers to the number of efforts that is in hours that has been put by an employee with respect to the work he or she has done for that particular client. So generally what happens in the companies like TCS, Wipro, Infosys, Capgemini, Accenture, you have a person who is working for eight hours, and for how many days he or she is working? Let's say they are working for 20 days in a month. Considering you have a holiday on uh, Saturday and Sunday. So they are working for 160 hours in a month. With respect to this, the company would be getting paid some X amount of money from the client. So this is a billing term. Now, these days what's happening, the companies are the clients are having a conversation with the companies and they are requesting companies to focus on solution driven models. This was a traditional service model in which you were being paid to work for X hours for some particular company. But now they are evolving into the solution driven model. So let me explain you with respect to the diagrams. Okay, so the IT business model is changing from billing to the solution-based model. So you can see this is traditional model in which earlier the key players were TCS, Wipro, Infosys, and many service-based companies, right? What was the business model? The client hires X number of resources who are getting paid in return to what the work they will be doing for that particular client. And the charges would be on hourly basis. And here the limitations is that they are dependent on cheap labor, they are focusing on manpower, not outcomes. So any company who knows, okay, 20 people are required into this project, they'll deploy 20 people into that particular project. 25, 30, 45, any number of people are getting deployed earlier. But now what is happening is there's a shift in focus, right? Now the clients are expecting the work done from the company actually, right? So earlier your work was, let's say, sitting eight hours, 10 hours working from that company and coming back again and resuming that particular task. But these days, the clients are looking for the solution-based model. So you can take an example of Zepsight, right? They offer delivery route optimization, right? So that includes real-time tracking, driver mobile application, self-scheduling, everything. So here, the client is getting benefited with the solution and not with respect to the billable resource. Of course, they'll pay. It's not like they are not paying, but they'll pay with respect to the ROI, with respect to the solution that you have given to them. So the model that is coming into the picture with respect to the IT is also the solution based. Hence, the jobs or the projects would be now driven by this particular model. So there is a change in the IT that is coming, right? And this change you will have to adopt. You'll have to focus, you'll have to showcase what solution, what value you have added into that particular task, right? Core value drivers. So what will be the core value drivers? Now, 
earlier what used to happen 25 people 30 people used to work for 30 dollars per hour or maybe 40 dollars per hour but now the core components would be the data engineering the domain expertise you need to be having the domain knowledge it's fine even if you you are not an sme or subject matter expert you should have that domain knowledge and then you will be able to get qualified for that particular project now you'll see the job opportunities also these days also many people they are telling there is a lot of demand of the finance based domain investment banking domain based domain e-commerce based domain so this kind of domain based job opportunities have started coming up so you'll have to showcase some projects that you have done in those particular domains in order to get qualified for such kind of job opportunities right so domain based calls you would be getting right so earlier what does it mean for the stakeholders what flag does it show for the stakeholders so earlier what does it mean you were supposed to build a large teams that's what was happening in the service based companies 50 people getting hired together 60 people getting hired together but now they will be reflect they will be redefining and they will be reflecting what kpi or what innovation or what roi they have achieved based on the impact based on the people that they are working in the project right so from get more hours to get more business value would be taken care so this is a big thing there's a big picture that i'm telling you but this is how the job market will be changing now since the companies would be changing the job market would be changing accordingly right the opportunity for you is to get into the driving mode right earlier it was for you was to just showcase that you have the skill set now you have to showcase how you have contributed in your project what differently you have done in your project what extraordinary you have done into your project what makes you different from the rest of the people in the companies or in the market out there right so that's very important value creation is very important right how will you drive the things is important so there is a change that is that is coming in the market from the billing to the value that has been put by that particular member is important so the focus is done on the solutions focus is done on the business value focus is done on the roi that has been achieved rather than the number of people that are there playing in the game right now it doesn't matter whether there are 10 people in the project or there are 20 people but it matters that if you are billing those 10 people or those 20 people you have to showcase what you have done what they have done for the project in the client or what extraordinary or what significance they have made being a part of that particular project so that's very important so now this will go on the valuation basis so when you are going for interviews or even if you are creating your resumes it becomes important that you showcase the contribution you showcase what value you have added you showcase a data driven approach in your resume maybe you were able to find 15 defects in the last three months which were pc or maybe you were able to increase the automation coverage from uh, 20% to 35%, right? Justifiable numbers. You should be speaking with respect to the data these days. And then and then only, once you will have all this kind of customization in your resume template, in your profile, on your Nokri profile, then and then only you'll be getting the calls. So that's the change. That's the shift that is happening into the IT market, right? So that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching this video. And many people were asking, what are the changes in the IT market? Will we get the jobs? How can we get more and more interview calls? So this is the change that has come, right? People now, they need to move their mindset. They need to shift their mindset from business model to the solution. Right? So that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching this video. And stay tuned for more updates.